Hi there, this is Lori and Rick. On one of our adventures out, we went to Twin Falls, Idaho and saw Shoshone Falls. This was in September when the water level is a bit lower, so not as much flow is coming over the falls, but it was still really neat to see. I found a picture of what it looks like in uh, certain times of the year, mainly in the springtime. Now you can see why they call this the Niagara of the West. Here we're seeing it from a platform that they have uh, down near the falls, but there's lots of areas that you can go in and view it. Here's one from up on top. There's a nice park with uh, some pullover areas that you can view a lot of the area of the falls and the Snake River Valley. We also decided to look at another area that um, they have on the Snake River there, and that is where Evil Knievel attempted his famous jump in his sky sickle. We're driving down the long uh, gravel road that's headed towards the mound that had the scaffolding on it where they launched his uh, sky sickle rocket off of. This is looking across the canyon. There's a nice signboard that gives you the information on his jump. This is from on top of the mound. Isn't this amazing? He was going to try to attempt to go clear across to the other side of the canyon. His parachute deployed about halfway over and he ended up at the bottom of the canyon, unfortunately. This is looking back down the back side of the mound. You can walk out around it or climb up the front of it. They have a lovely bike path or walking path going along the canyon wall. I wish I had brought my e-bike so that I could have explored it more. Oh, up on top of the mound. There's Rick. Hi, Rick. <laughs> 